Welcome to another Swag Academy tutorial. Today we're going to be talking about the Bumble Boost, which as of the date of this recording, early 2020, has about four main features. I'm going to walk you through each one of them. Just kind of a snapshot here is what the, um, the main page of the profile looks like and where you would go. You would just head over to your profile and then go to where it says manage your boost. That's where we're going to get started. We're going to just briefly cover the four points um, as it is right now for Bumble and um, yeah let's get right into it so as you can see there these are the pricing points we're gonna come back to those in a second um, but let's start with the very first thing that you would get if you do opt into the Bumble boost so the B line as you guys have seen is the list of matches that you have but they're sort of behind the curtain so you don't know who these uh, people are who the ladies would be um, so the B line with the Bumble boost it says it shows you who has already liked you. So if we go back and look at this queue here, as you can see, they're blurred out. So I have no idea who these ladies are. Uh, but if I wanted to have a look at the profiles uh, before I've even swiped them, I would upgrade to the boost. And then it brings me back to the same page. Um, I've personally never, never used it, uh, never needed to. Uh, but it's a personal choice it, you know the boost is there it's sort of I guess it streamlines the process makes it a little more efficient or if you don't if you're busy you don't really have time uh, and you want to just sort of fast track the process and see who's liked you first you know um, that's what it's there for let's go to the second point so the second is unlimited filters let you find that special someone so let's let's talk about what the filters are exactly because this is kind of back in your profile settings and first I'm going to show you what that looks like Oop. I don't know why it locked me out, logged me out there for a second but uh, okay so in your settings as you can see these are the filters right you can see I'm interested in women um, the basic filters are the age range the distance now here's where we get to those advanced filters that you have to sort of scroll down should look pretty similar on a, on a cell phone so the free version when you don't have boosts only allows a maximum of two filters so for me personally the main thing was uh, smokers or non-smoking uh, that was my number one thing that I didn't that I wanted to set and do I even have a second one I don't even know if I do Anyway, it, uh, it seems to allow for up to two filters. However, uh, as you can see with the boost, so it says upgrade for more filters. Um, there's different things here. If, you, you know, if, you're, if you're specific about whether you want uh, the, the, the matches to have a specific lifestyle, like exercise, education level, if you want to be drinkers or non-drinkers, if you're adamant that it has to be a pet person or a pet lover or a pet owner, you can certainly put that if you're looking for people that are exclusively 420 friendly you know you can be specific if you're a single parent you want to meet another single parent exclusively and you're not into dating uh, people without kids or vice versa maybe you don't have kids and you don't want to date people that do you can set those filters up again it just streamlines the process you know if you're adamant about politics religion i'm sure there's more filters so that's what the boosts are for you upgrade for more filters and boom, it takes you back to the pricing page. So I think this is really good for somebody that's like a really busy professional or just has a lot going. And, um, you know, if uh, you just find your price point, sort of what you you, you, you want to try it for one day, a week, a month. I do like that Bumble gives you multiple options there. Oftentimes you'll find you get one to three options, but um, they're giving you six. And obviously the more you... Um, um, sign up for they, they cut you a deal they give you some savings um, if I was going to do this personally I would probably try it for a week just to see how it sort of how it goes and how, how beneficial it is to me and then if I like it and it's really helping me in the process then I'd probably go for the you know the six month um, for the better savings uh, I've personally never done it but um, certainly something I'd uh, you know if, if I was struggling with, with matches or for whatever reason if i just wanted to make it quicker and save myself time let's go to the third point here unlimited rematches mean mismatches are a thing of the past so this is something like for example for me right now 
I could um, I could use, and I'll show you why. I think I was seeing that I had a mismatch. This was just from yesterday, which is weird because I think I was I was on the app yesterday. For some reason, I didn't see this one, or I missed it. You know, uh, we matched with each other, but I didn't I didn't uh, respond on time, so I, I missed it, right? And, and it's too late because um, I didn't reach out in time. And I went through this girl's profile; she was cute and everything, and I would have definitely talked to her, but uh, because I missed the window of time in order to rematch again it takes me back to the boost and and it depends like I said everyone's got different uh, priorities for me again if I if if I was struggling not finding many matches or if I didn't have options open I would maybe consider it um, but I'm I'm not worried I let these go it's too bad you know you know we could have possibly uh, had a connection but I've got other matches uh, all the time so that's fine the last one here Unlimited extends give you an extra 24 hours for every match. Uh, for this, I kind of had to grab some uh, screenshots here because um, this is, by the way, what the rematches look like. I think I've shown you this when you choose to rematch girls that you've missed, which is what I just showed you. Now, these are the ones, if you look at the top there where you see the red in the circle, that's where they're almo I'm almost out of time 22 minutes, six minutes left, 20 minutes on this one. So this is kind of an, an old screenshot. Yeah, you see Michelle, I had lost there. It expired yesterday, so I was could have been. Sometimes I spend weekends uh, where I often date the most, and I don't really go on the app. Um, I set up my dates sort of during the week and then go on them on weekend, and that's when I miss matches because people are still swiping my profile, but I'm not on the app as much. I may have lost this one as well with 20 minutes left. I think I had another one where... Same thing, this one at 26 minutes left. So let's say hypothetically I missed that match um, or, I, or I caught it on time, I should say, and I wanted to extend it. That boost allows me to extend the 24 hours uh, unlimited where the free version allows you to do one extend per day. So let's say you have two or three or four ladies that you're running out of time with. Um, on the free version, you have to just pick one. You, you can only choose, I guess, whatever one you like the most and then potentially let the other ones go. But with the Bumble Boost, it says unlimited extent. So you could potentially have uh, two or three matches that uh, are running at a time. You can extend them all if they haven't reached out to you. So again, it just widens the net for you. It makes it a little bit easier. Um, you're catching your, you know, not as many girls are falling through the cracks. So all in all, you know, as far as a review of this, it's, uh, it, you know, it, it does get several things accomplished. Again, if you uh, struggle just getting matches uh, all together for quantity or quality, or if you're just extremely busy and you or you just <laughs> um, don't have the patience to go, you know, and spend the time that's necessary on this app, you want to just get in and out five minutes and find your matches, then, then give it a try. Give the Bumble Boost a try. Uh, as always, for more training, guys, head over to swagacademy.com uh, for lots of dating advice, and uh, I hope you enjoyed this video.